When tripping pipe or bringing it up from the seafloor, they bring up three at a time, roughly 100 feet every two and a half minutes. Once it's on deck, it's then moved onto the skate rack. At this point, you can really see the stand of pipes start to flex. As it's pushed over to the pipe racker, watch this hard steel pipe wobble. And then wobble some more. Here's a closer look at how flimsy the steel appears and how this rigid steel tube wobbles. Core barrels, which house the sediment and rock drilled from beneath the seafloor, slide up these pipes back to the Joides resolution. Amazingly, the team can assemble 15,000 feet of the steel pipe and get it to the bottom in about seven hours. It takes about 375 horsepower to turn the drill bit at the end. That's about as much as a V8 engine on a 1992 Chevy Corvette ZR1.